I want a round of applause for Dooms Hall. Hello, Fred. Hello, fellow freedom fighters. I think that's a great terminology, and it is the message of the day. I gotta tell you, driving out here today, I just got myself so wound up and so mad. It's just eating me up that the Annette and, and Victor Fuente's wonderful Patch of Heaven church camp has turned into a living hell, and I don't like it. I don't like it at all. I moved to Nevada for freedom. Freedom to gamble. I don't gamble. Freedom to go to a brothel. Freedom to drink 24 hours a day. And I haven't had a drink since I was 17. Freedom to carry my gun. That's why I moved here for freedom. And I see that freedom being taken away from us. It is disgusting. And us freedom fighters have to do something about it. It's, it's, it's outrageous what's happening. Our, our, I'm watching our state just go to hell and the leadership is not doing their job, not doing their job at all. And we have to get boisterous about it. You know, I, I think back at the, at the Bundys and, you know, my American heroes, and I, I want you to know I was, yes, I was I was at the prison, I was protesting, I was doing everything we could, but you know what, we didn't do enough. And we all should have, we all should have pushed, pushed harder and harder. And I look at what's what's going on, and it's like they take away our burrows, they, they take away the horses, especially in northern Nevada, where there's a ton of them up there. They take the, the cattle ranchers and they put them out of business, and now they got a problem because they say there's too much vegetation and there's a fire problem. Well, let the farmer, the ranchers do what they do, let the horses do what they do, and the burros do what they do, and we don't have a problem. The problem is the U.S. government can get out of our lives, get out of the battle. We need to do something about the BLM. In my mind, go away. Who knows how to govern our state and our county than us? Nobody knows how to do it better than us. And it's time that we all start doing something about it. And where, yeah, right. And where, where are our, our, our U.S. government people? Where, where are the legislatures? You know, the guy I'm running against, you don't see him here. And get me elected, get me elected to the legislature, and I will continue in the steps of my good friend Ed Goodhart, who did an amazing job. Yes, give her out your applause. And, and I will use my notoriety, my celebrity, my media connections to fight against this government to do the right thing. They've just got to stop. I mean, I, I see what they did to the Pandis, it was disgusting. I see what they've done to the Fuentes, they ruined this church camp and their lives, and they're wrong, they're totally wrong. I've watched what they've done for me, because I'm running for office, the last 18 months has been hell for me, trying to take my business away, trying to take my taxes, which I pay absorbent taxes, and run them from 29,000 to 120,000, to put me out of business, every county commissioner's meeting, they're here trying to do something to me to put me out of business. And the, the one that fights for me is right here, Donna Cox, uh, yeah. giving a round of applause. Yeah. Donna, you're the best. We have to get rid of people like Dirty Dan Shinhoffen, anybody yeah. but Shinhoffen, yeah. anybody. We, we have to get Tina Trenner, uh, elected to take uh, Butch's place yes, and get people yeah. in here that will fight for us and fight for our water before we're all on wells and we can't even have a plant outside our house. Yeah. We've just got to do this and the answer is to, to vote, get people voted into office, get new county commissioners and, and push our federal uh, legislators uh, like Danny Cartanian who's going go to go to Congress for us and people like that and push them to do their damn job and let's get the BLM out of Nye County. I don't want to do it. All right, well, I'm glad all us freedom fighters are thinking the same way. Now it's time to just get out and do it and do everything we can to support the Fuentes. Uh, I'm doing it and it just makes me sick coming out here. It makes me mad and it's time we all do something about it and step up and make something happen. 
uh, rather than just sitting around and letting things happen. It's time to go to work and just tell me what the direction you want me to go in, and I'm going for it. I'm going for it big time. All right? Thank you.